Neiman and I are checking into our little Airbnb for the night. There they are. <laughs> All right, we have hit about nine sales. Stop. Neiman and I are checking into our little Airbnb for the night. Mom is staying at Nana's and then we just decided to get our own place so that we didn't have to sleep on the couch. But it's so cute. Let's look inside. Sleep. Yep. Nice. Smells good. A little cottage. At the bathroom? Is it one bedroom? I think so. That's a bedroom. Creepy. So cool. I like oh, this layout though. It's gosh, all open. Look at the floor. Nice. This floor would bug me living here though. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not living here. You just visit. You remember this type of phone, Sherry? <laughs> Show us how it works. Listen here, young man. We're unloading. I'm ready to drink some beer. Go. Did you unhook that? Oh, I didn't know yours was tied in too. Yeah, I hooked it all together so mom would not freak out. I see. They didn't even budge. They didn't go anywhere. We had to tie these in because Miss Sherry thought they were going to fly away <laughs> on the drive. All my logic in the world couldn't save that from not happening. It's so cute down it here. Is. It is. I'm a dope little spot. I don't know if there's AC. Hopefully there's AC. I don't see any fan in our room. Look at this tub. <laughs> It's so small. You'd have to like crouch down in there. It it's looks mainly. nice though. I know it's mainly for showering, but cute little bathroom. It's an interesting toilet cover. Cool. Let's see the back porch. We can bring back beers here tonight. Okay. So A little take... feng shui. Those in. Little Edison lights. Cute. Honey, I'm home. That's cool. Oh, you got some of the good stuff. Coffee bar. Nice. Yim, um, is this going to be good enough for you in the morning or are we going to go to Hazel's? We're going to Hazel's for you. Because <laughs> I got the drink that she wants. I'd rather figure it out than look at the directions she sent. <laughs> RB 
barbecue, chicken, pizza. Pineapple. For all you pineapple haters out there. Are you guys pineapple on pizza? No? Okay. I'm not pineapple. Period? Period. Like, Alright. I don't mind it. I like it better than I used to. Say hi. <laughs> Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> That's it, Uncle Richard. There he is. And that's Aunt Valerie. That's my mom's sister. And Nana, she'll be back. She'll be back. <laughs> How's the pizza? Um, nine out of ten. The breadsticks, nine and a half out of ten. We had this place once before, but I don't remember it being so good, but it's I'll eat this whole pizza. Good morning guys. We got home or got back to the Airbnb like I don't know, maybe nine. No, 10.30, 10, 10.30, something like that. We just had a really great time with um, some families. You guys got to meet my aunt and uncle. I forgot to tell to show you Nana, but luckily we are gonna be meeting back up with her in a few minutes. So I wanted to tell you guys what we are actually here for. And um, I'm just gonna get ready for the day while I do that. They have this cool like little vanity area in the Airbnb and it's really nice because the bathroom is really small and there's two of us. Nina needs to use the bathroom to brush his teeth and stuff so I can use this area to put my makeup on. Kind of nice. Anyway, today, this morning and all day, we are going to be going to some garage sales and the garage sales are on this highway called highway 48 and it's in missouri and basically there's over 30 or 40 houses that have garage sales so what better time to go than now when you can just hit them all they do this every single year so they're pretty skilled at it. They have a map for the whole place. Everyone who's participating is on the map. That way you know where to go, you know which houses to skip, so on and so forth. They have like a, a little in the center area. There's like place for lunch, stuff like that. So we are super excited. My mom, Nana, and I went two years ago now and I found some pretty good stuff. Like, you know, it's just fun to look. So I think that's really the thrill of it in general. We are looking for a few things in particular. Um, Neiman and I are looking for like pots to put plants in and like plant stands. And then also, what else? Like. Oh, I want to look for like some staging decor. I got a ton of stuff for the walls, um, like pictures and stuff, but I want to also have some more like vases and different knickknacky, not knickknacky things, but things that would look nice to stage pieces of furniture with. And then what else? I don't know. We had a couple of other things as well. We made a list so that way we don't forget the other things that we're looking for particularly. And then of course we're always on the hunt for things that will look good in the Airbnb. And then, let me see. This. And then we are also always, always on the look for good deals for furniture. So yeah, that is what we are up to today. And we just figured that we'd bring you guys along as well. So we are gonna finish getting ready and then we're gonna go meet up with mom and Nana. They're gonna hop in the truck and then we're gonna be on our merry way. Got some morning sun peeking through. It's a beautiful morning. Pretty cool scenes around. The Airbnb, some cool architecture on the homes. Kind of reminds me of Chicago as well. Two, three, one, nine. 
course, we've got to get this man his coffee. So, Hazel's, if you guys are in St. Joe, Missouri, it's a great spot, right? It's a great spot to get some Joe in St. Joe. I had to. It's pretty good. Lauren wants hers heated up, so she's not gonna eat hers yet, but. I got a cookies and cream frappuccino, or frappe. Frappe. And you even got a, his classic. Cold brew, shot of espresso, splash of oat milk, and some sugar-free vanilla. We're late. <laughs> we're late, are we? Yeah, we were supposed to meet them at 10.30. <laughs> oh, that took like 20 minutes in there. I know, it did, 25 probably. There was yeah. one person on a Friday at 7.30 yeah. at like one of the only coffee shops in the damn place. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, it's good coffee. It's worth it, kind of, but also we got food, but yeah, it just took forever. How's the burrito? Hot. But, check back in in a few minutes. <laughs> I'll give you a more accurate review. Well, my bagel sandwich is great. Well, what's the verdict? We've checked it in. Eight and a half out of ten. Salsa, 9.3. Nice and thick. Got a little spice to it, but not overbearing. I'm gonna have the last bite be full of salsa. This is the trick to the last bite here, people. This is a trick that you're going too slow because this is the, my passing of. You got salsa on that side, okay, 90 degree angle, salsa on both sides. Hey, you got 90 degrees of salt in How was it? <laughs> Hot or spicy? It's all in the roof of my mouth. <laughs> that was good. I could eat two of those. It's already making me toot a little bit. to being told when to turn at the last minute, so don't <laughs> feel like you're... I got the map. <laughs> oh, we're in trouble. All right, we got our map. We got our passengers. We got our backpack. We got our backpack. Backpack, oh. backpack. <laughs> and uh, we got our coffee. Now all we need is some good garage sale and finds. I told you I had a burrito <laughs> and it was moving right through me as soon as I finished the last bite. Do not put that on your vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Lauren was just saying, or no, Sherry said that Lauren doesn't need to worry about her getting in the car all day. And then Lauren says, but you're worrying about Nana all day. And then I said, I'm in the first, I'm in the car with all the same persons. <laughs> I got three duplicates in the car. <laughs> oh, just a degree different as you get to the generation. <laughs> and you love us all. And I love them all. <laughs> On to the next spot. What do you say? Oh, we got some we got some silverware at the blog, or at the <laughs> We got some silverware at the second garage sale for the Airbnb. So five dollars. Great quality silverware. Great find. So far we're finding some good prices at both of the sales that we've been to. So that's a good sign. Hopefully that continues throughout the day. I think Nana, Nana, what'd you get there? I bought a plant, an airplane plant. Airplane plant. What does that look like? Is it close by? You don't have to get down. Oh, yeah. See, it's starting to take off. I see it. There we go. Okay. Airplane plant and then cherry. Nothing just yet. Just a win on the domino. Oh, no, that was valid. I just like looking. <laughs> I just what, like looking. What's your favorite thing to try to look for or look at? She just like Other people's at junk. Other people's junk. <laughs> As with everybody that's watching this video, too. It's always fascinating. We're on number three now. A little bit of a walk. So pretty out here. I 
Taking over vlog duties, everybody. Look at this setup. I got this going back. Nice. Cute. For Amora. Now, how much? 25 cents. For Amora's name is We found ourselves some lemon bread. Homemade, you like the end? Yeah. Okay, taste testers here. It's Jillian's homemade goods. You too, good to see you. Here in middle of nowhere, Missouri. It's good. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Delicious? Mm -hmm. I already knew before I tasted it. Nice and moist. Yeah. Nice potent lemon flavor. Mm -hmm. I hope I just had a cup of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Nana. There's a cow down there. That's how you know we're in the country. It's a chocolate cow. Chocolate milk cow. Yeah. Yum. So I just found these really neat art pieces and they're only 25 cents and they're super old. There's that. There's that. This is like felt kind of or something. It's like painted on felt. And then there's this one as well. All right, the pictures are secured in the back here. There's no more room where Nana and Mom are sitting, so I've got to start putting stuff back here. Hopefully it doesn't blow out. Find anything? Me? Yeah. No. Oh, I was sad. Did you see that bench? Is, that would have been good for your garage. Yeah. I don't need it. We got yeah, our own built-in. Link in. system. Yeah, and we got our own built-in. Oh, hey. You can't record me recording you record me. <laughs> no, I'm recording you recording me recording you. <laughs> Nike jacket, potentially. That looks good, it's only three bucks. Yeah. Zips, it's white and there's no stains. Uh, Stain? It's like very slight, but I don't know, I think. See it? Super slight though. I mean, it's like, can't, uh, it's because now I know it's there. Turn around. The back yeah. looks good. Is it looks gray good. In the back or is it white? White. <laughs> Here you go. Three dollars. <laughs> Thank give you, sugar you mama. your money. Just it. His first purchase. Your first purchase. Trip worth it. Hi, Sophie. Hi, little guy. Hello. Hi. You, you're so cute. All right. We have hit about nine sales, and we are at the bathroom stop, which is um, in the Rosendale. It's that one, Mom. That one's green. Jeez, Louise. She thought Nana went in that one, but that one was red that one was green I don't know what she was doing anyway we are on a bathroom break um they've been doing this garage sale thing on this highway for years and years so they've planned like this is kind of the middle and they've got the public restrooms for the day 
And then also you can get lunch around here as well, but we packed lunch, so we'll be doing that in a little bit. We already broke open the brownies, if you know what I mean. Liam got his jacket that he's super happy about. He said that it was all worth it because he found that. For $3. Three dollars. Three dollars. Nike. Nike. And it's got like some Phoenix Suns colors so I can wear it during game day if we're out at a restaurant and it's chilly inside. <laughs> He's already got it all thought through. Nana's got it. All kinds of things. For all the great, great, no, just great, great. Just great, friend. Great, great. <laughs> Uh, two little twinkles. Two dollars each for Finn and Anders. Well, yeah, I don't know. I think you put your cigarette in there, but I just thought they were funny. All right, we're at the next one. I think it's like 11. But they got a greenhouse and uh, like a whole plant business. So we're crossing our fingers that we can potentially get some plants here. And it's also super, super windy. Maybe we don't lose the hat. So I got four pots. I'll probably paint them. A $25 mirror super long and it's wood I believe and it's like old so I don't know I think I just totally okay let me try again <laughs> we've got a $25 mirror here it's long it's old I think it's made of wood I'm pretty sure it gets hung like sideways technically you could hang it the other way if you changed it up, but I think we might get this. What do you think? I think it'd be sweet for staging, but in the Airbnb. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Well, this is part of the fun, but we just went down a really long road and thought there was a garage sale and then there wasn't. I think people forgot to take their signs down from last year. Wait, does that say garage sale? Oh, yeah, it does. Oh, maybe this is Wait, maybe this is, this is it. Place? Oh, here it is. Oh, okay. We missed we oh, just it. Oh, it was hidden. it. Okay. We found it. Sweet. We're all good. <laughs> all right. We missed it, but it's right there. We couldn't see it from the road. This is blocked. But here it is. And I believe this is number 14. Sounds about right. That was a bus, huh? What are we seeing most of? Clothes. <laughs> clothing. We're just going crazy with clothes. Clothing, clothing. That's okay. We're having fun. Hey. Hey. There nope. you again. Videoing me, videoing, recording me, recording me. Yeah, I got a different angle. <laughs> oh, I bumped my head. <laughs> <laughs> For the second time of the day. In the same spot. <laughs> I think it was because when I was lifting her up, she jumped. Or like, she jumped. <laughs> I thought she was in, and, and then I heard. Getting in this truck when you're 60, a little tough in the back seat when it's so tall. Okay, we made it to the auction house where there's a ton of stuff outside and inside. So we are got, we got our work cut out for us here. Sorry if the audio is bad, it's really windy, but still want to bring you guys along, so you'll have to deal with it. Sherry found a watering pot. This is what we were looking for. It's probably a little too small, like they both said, but at least it's something for us. So. It'll help us water one plant. Yeah, <laughs> right now we ain't watering any plant. Some furniture, 
two little end tables. Those aren't bad. A desk. There. Yeah. And then a couple of dressers here. A vanity. Chair. likes that plant stand. You guys like that plant stand for indoor plants? Where's the water gonna drain out? What do you mean? Yeah, I know, but then like, if it's indoor, it's just gonna go bloop, 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 bloop. I'm wipe it up. That's for outside. Well, that's for an outside plant. We can respray it and put it inside and then put a water catcher attached to the bottom. It's a lot of work. All right, we stopped for lunch. So we gotta grab the cooler. Sandwiches are made. And they're very yummy. And done. <laughs> I told him I'd make him too. Ten. That was it. Wonderful. Our, our little picnic. It looks like a little bit of Marilyn wind. Monroe with the wind blowing through your hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the chocolate brownie on the face. Banana mint brownies. Yeah, we're done with lunch. We are headed up to this garage sale that we used their yard for, for our lunch. It's a beautiful day. It's just windy. All right, we decided that we are turning around on this highway. So we're going back the way we came from. We did kind of skip a couple because this man was driving a little bit too quick <laughs> and they just kept coming up on us um, but also it kind of gives us something to do on the way back that way we're not just like drive back and so we have a few more garage sales to hit we've hit 16 from her uh, count so I don't know if it's too accurate but uh, <laughs> and we're having a great time. Woo! 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 Chicken box. Great time, Nana. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Not too shabby. I love to hear it. Eight bucks. You could put two. Yeah, you could. Eight bucks.
See, look, sail in back look, this right way. Here. And that's from Walmart, but I like it. It'll match in my office. Okay, I found a frame. It was 75 cents. And then she's like, wait, that's wrong. It's only 25 cents. And I was like, okay, well, I've got a dollar. You got change. She said, you know what, just take it. So we got a free frame. This is gonna go in my office. And I'm gonna put a little picture in it of something, I don't know, some family or an even an eye, something like that. back where we began at the little rest stop area we're dropping off nana to go um, into her car and head home we had a great day neiman left his bag at our airbnb last night his like laptop bag and stuff so we had to cut the day a little bit short um Oops. Short, shorter than we Plan. planned on i guess so that's all right it's about two o'clock we started about eight o'clock, so five hours of garage sailing, a lot of driving up and down the roads, um, but we came out with a pretty good amount of stuff. So we're gonna see Nana off and go get the bag. And then of course, we'll give you guys a haul. It's so good. <laughs> yeah. Stop bullying me for eating the good brownies. It's a sign of respect in many cultures. All right, we picked up Ian's bag from the Airbnb. Don't ever do that again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, and now we decided to stop by the Habitat for Humanity Restore in St. Joe. I have never been able to come in here uh, because every time I try to come in, they're closed um, on like Sundays and one time on Monday and on holidays and all of that. So we finally get to go and um, Check it out. There's a furniture room, Mom. Oh. Oh, snap. Oh, Ooh, there's your, there's a bed for your this one? Some room. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be nice, but it's, I think that they're gonna be too long. That's about like 10 more inches. That would fit right in there. 88 inches, not gonna fit, trust me. We already measured for a couch that I really wanted, but it didn't fit. Remember? Yeah. Yeah. It needs to be about 80 inches, period. You want to put it on the end? Oh, that looks comfy. Yeah, and it's got legs. Yeah, so. That's a fine. 45? 35. 45. Oh, 40. But it's been here for a while, right? A long time. I don't know if that'll be one deal. Ask, would you do 30? We what do you guys think? Come on. Like Come on, help me out here. Skinny. Help me out here. What do you hear? What are your thoughts? Right there. We wanted like a skinny, I want like a skinny, there you go. like end table. Just one though. Remember, I only want one. Yeah. What do you think? 45 too much? No? Are you going to sell it? Yeah, sell it. Yeah. It's in good shape, ain't it? But you can try to get it a little cheaper. That's pretty neat. 175. Eggs. 175? Look at the finish. <laughs> Look at the cracks. They just think that it's because, oh, and uh, like vintage. Mm -hmm. Let's forget about what condition it is in. Because it's vintage. Come on, y'all. I need to go around. I need to create a consultation company 
that goes around to thrift stores, restores, and gets them understanding how to price their pieces to sell. We've got a business to run here, okay? We're not trying to hit home runs on every piece that we get into the well, restore. Well, it is a nonprofit. This yeah. one's particularly. A nonprofit? Mm-hmm. All of them all are, of aren't they? Goodwill's a nonprofit, ain't it? No? I don't know about that. Oh. Well, regardless, we need to make sure that we're sticking to our mission, and that's to build homes, habitat for humanity. If this is sitting here because the $175 versus $60, $60 going towards the next habitat for humanity home build is what we want, not $175 sitting here equating to $0 going towards the homes for Decided to pass on the blue chair because it's supposed to rain and we have an open truck and yeah, we don't want it to get all wet. So no chair. Yeah, but this restore, it's a lot bigger and nicer than ours. The prices are like, eh, some are good, some are like, whoa, that's not good, but yeah. So if you're ever in St. Joseph, Missouri and you want to go to Habitat for Humanity Restore, hit them up. This is all we came away with from the Restore. We needed some more bungee cords because all of ours are like sun scorched and Water. taken apart. Yeah. So we're going to take better care of these ones. These are going to stay in the truck. That's my mom's house when she was growing up. Three years. And it was a hundred from our wonderful trip. We ended up hitting 20 garage sales. So although we didn't get to hit all of them, that's okay. We still had a really good time and that's what matters most. And then also we came away with some pretty good stuff. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick little haul. So my first find was this set of silverware for $5, not a bad price at all. This is in really nice shape. We are either gonna be putting it in the Airbnb upstairs or in our longer term area where we're going to be renting it out hopefully to some nurses. I don't know the order anymore. <laughs> I just know that that was first but next we picked up some clothing for Neiman's niece Amora. We got a little cute heart shirt with bedazzled jewels. We've got some jean shorts, super cute, and then a little butterfly skort um, which we thought were super cute and each were just 25 cents. So they almost look brand new. We got a brand new frame, hasn't been used for free. Uh, so again, I'm gonna probably put that in my office, maybe like a picture of Neiman and I or some family, something like that. And we also grabbed some canvases. And I told you guys at the garage sale, but these are just great for like DIY purposes. So you don't always have to like what's in the actual canvas, but knowing that these canvases are usually $30 and we got them for 50 cents each, a dollar for two canvases that we can make either some staging art out of or art for like your own home. Maybe I'll make it for the Airbnb. That is gonna be a really fun DIY project down the road. And then we picked up these pieces of art. I have no idea any information about them, honestly. I think some of them were hand painted and maybe we'll have to do some more digging about the other two, but this one I thought was really cool. It says that it was hecho en Mexico, which means made in Mexico. So this is probably like a Mexican painting and 
Yeah, I just, I don't know. We thought they were super neat and only for 25 cents a piece. So we got four pieces of art for a dollar. And then we picked up these two. These two are very unique and very old, I think. Um, so I, they look similar, but they're not the same. Um, probably made in the same you know, by the same person. It's felt back here, and then it looks like it's painted on the felt. Next, we picked up some pots because we are collecting plants and we have yet to repot some of our plants. So we started, we don't necessarily want to buy brand new pots because that can get pretty pricey. So we found these for 50 cents each. I actually did have four, but even broke one. So now we're down to three, but they were 50 cents each. So we were in about $2 here. Um, and this one I just noticed actually does say Mexico on the bottom. They, this one does too. So again, could be something from uh, made from Mexico. I'm not really, I mean, that would only make sense. Neiman picked this up. It is a super cool find for just $3. And um, it's actually a Nike jacket. It had a slight stain right on this side, but I washed it when we got home and that stain actually came out. But it looks like I'm gonna need to wash it again because Neiman got some stain on it already. <laughs> and then last but not least, but probably my favorite find of the day is this mirror. It was only $25 and it is, from what I can see, it is super, an, a very old mirror. The lady that was selling it was talking about how it was her grandparents' mirror. And so she was probably in her 70s. And so if you think about it, it could be, you know, anywhere from 80 to 100 years old. Super awesome. Um, we are probably going to be putting this in the Airbnb. In total, I don't know, we, we wrote it down throughout the trip. We, like I said, we hit about 25 garage sales, um, but I can't exactly remember how much we spent, but I would say under $50 at that garage sale to get all this stuff. So not a bad haul here. Nana came away with some things. Mom came away with one thing for my nephews. So super successful trip. Like I said, we just had a really great time together as well. And at the end of the day, isn't that what matters the most? All right, so that is gonna be it for this vlog, you guys. I am going to be going to put all of this stuff away, and then we are going to be heading over to the Airbnb so you can look out for some more Airbnb content here next week. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you on the flip side. <laughs>